Yeah. Hello and how are you? Hey friends, welcome to the Shin Show. I am your host, Shenandoah Briscoe, coming to you from right here in St. Charles, Missouri. Hey, this here is Sunday, June the 4th, 2017, B-Blog number 2106. Hey, got a happy birthday shout out going out to Patty Douglas Brackensack and Kimberly Crow. Uh, Daryl Moon and Austin Briscoe. So, there you have it. Oh, by the way, Gary Abbott. Remember Gary Abbott I was telling you about? One of the members of the Hackensack uh, Hall of Fame. Well, he's got an iTube. Uh, you go to iTube 247, you can look up Gary Abbott and listen to a few of his, uh, his, 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 uh, videos. There you go. Alrighty. So, without further ado, here we go. I said, hey, I heard it's your birthday today. So, happy birthday, I must say. Patty, Kimberly, Daryl, Austin, eh, happy birthday to you today. Well, hey, I heard it's your birthday today. So, happy birthday, I must say. So, Patty, Kimberly, Daryl, and Austin, there's a one more year gone away. So, happy birthday to you today. And many more. Alrighty then. Yep, Austin, that's my nephew there. And, uh, Kimberly, that would be my nighttime caregiver's daughter. And Patty, she's a friend of mine from school. Daryl, I'm not gonna say how I know Daryl. He is one of my Facebook friends, though. So, that's not saying that I don't like Daryl. It's just saying I'm not exactly sure how I know Daryl. But, anyway. Uh, let's see what else we're going to talk about today. i tell you what. Sun is shining and the heat is burning down on us. Boy, 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 it's a hot one out there today. Boy, boy, boy. Uh, let's see. What is the temperature out there today? Oh, well. Let's see. Temperature out there today is... Um, is... Um, 82. 82 degrees right now. What do we got going on? You know, you know, tomorrow, today, tomorrow, tomorrow, today, Thursday. Uh, that would be the, uh, 12th, June 8th, Thursday the 8th, um, we got, uh, uh, Art Foundry Day, so let's not forget about that, if you want to go over to the second Thursdays at the Foundry Art Center, Foundry Art Center proudly present, presents second Thursdays live uh, living uh, living art a series of free art making events that highlights the importance of art to each person's well-being and unlimited possibilities that nature supplies to be creative each week will feature a building block of life that is a cultural physical or mental necessity for life. Local artists will lead art-making activities around these themes for everyone to enjoy and participate in. This week, Thursday, coming up, they're kicking off the second Thursday season by firing up our imagination. We will be getting creative by using natural materials that are not typically considered uh, when creating art, like grass, corn husks, branches, and more plants and materials. Local artists will lead visitors in other art-making activities that will spark the imagination. And as always, it's free so you'll find yourself around 5.30 p.m. to 8 p.m. down at the Foundry Art Center, 
which is located at 520 North Main Street. Main Center, St. Charles. Okay, well, it's the ACF area there. So, 520 North Main Center, St. Charles. It's basically right after you go past Main Street. It's on your left. You can pull in there. Or you can just go on around Riverside there on Clark. And uh, after you pass, pass Main Street on Clark, then you can pull in there. Uh, you get, you hit. Hey, I got a muscle spasm today, and it's digging on me, I must say. It's got me pinned back to my chair, and I'm going to let it just leave me there. Uh, uh, trying to get this chair turned on. There we go. Well, I'm in the wrong mood. Can't get there from there. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. Next time you see my face, I'm going to be pretty much kissing the screen. All right. Well, I'm not exactly kissing the screen, but I am a lot closer. Oh, Lordy, Lordy, Lordy. That was a muscle spasm, and it was just a beating me down. Beating me down. All right, let's see what else we got other than the art foundry. How about the St. Charles Municipal Band Concert? Ah, uh, June. June. How about June 1st? That ain't right. It's every Thursday. So, they'll be out there this Thursday. So, that'll be the 8th. That's right. St. Charles Municipal Band Concerts. Bring you a lawn chair and enjoy the music of the St. Charles Municipal Band as they play big band sounds from the early band era. That's right. Bring a lawn chair, blanket, family and friends and enjoy the outdoor concert free to the public. That's right, every Thursday, 8 p.m. at Frontier Park. That's 222 South Riverside Drive, St. Charles, Missouri. Come on down and enjoy the show. Alright, let's see, what else? What else do we got? Ooh, we can't forget the St. Charles Community Big, ba big Jazz Band. June the 11th, they'll be out there uh, recurring monthly on the second Sunday of the month. Come on down and enjoy an evening of jazz. Bring along chair, blankets, family, and friends, and enjoy jazz music on in Frontier Park. Again, that's 222 South Riverside Drive, Frontier Park, St. Charles, Missouri. Every second Sunday. All right. That'll be June 11th through July 9th. All right. Hey, this month we've got Beale Street Concert Series starting up. Actually, they started up last month, but that's quite all right. Hey, Beale Street. All right. All of the unique streets of St. Charles restaurants and retail Retails will set up booths on Beale Street for all patrons to enjoy. Come listen to Super Jam. Super Jam is a cover band, and they are great. I tell you, I listened to a few of their songs the other day on their website, and they are good. It's a free Beale Street concert series, the second Wednesday of each month, May through September. Food and beverages provided by the wonderful restaurants at the streets of St. Charles. Bring a lawn chair and enjoy the show. That'd be 1650 Beale Street, St. Charles, Missouri. 
in the fantabulous streets of St. Charles Shopping Plaza. Right there behind uh, Philip 60, or no, Quick Trip, where uh, Noah's Ark used to be, off of 5th Street. All righty then, hey. No rain dates, no coolers, and no outside food and beverages. So, all righty then. What else we got going on? Do we got anything else going on? Anything spectacular? How about the ninth annual Wing Ding? Mm, wing a ding ding. Dig a ding, dig a ding, dig a dig a dig a ding. Of course, it's uh, over at the family arena, so, you know, it's going to cost you $35 to $50 to get in there, so I won't be advertising that one. Too bad. New Mally Festival. There you go. Get yourself down to New Mally. New Mally Festival. All right. Uh, it's going to be recurring uh, daily from June the 15th through June 17th. Thursday, it'll start off at 6 p.m. and run to 10 p.m. Friday, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. And Saturday, 1 p.m. to 10 p.m. 4700 Highway Z, New Melly, Missouri. Admission $2 Thursday, $5 Friday, and Saturday. 12 and under are free. Well, I wouldn't have been advertising that had I known it was going to cost you to get in there. Alrighty then, is that about it? Wine Country Fest, I'm sure that'll cost. Uh, Pride of St. Charles Festival. Um, well, I don't have any Pride in St. Charles. Fun, family, friendly, free to attend. Great live entertainment all day on MasterCard Main Stage. Nearly 100. It's 500 South River Dri Riverside Drive, St. Charles, Missouri. Frontier Park. Great live entertainment all day on the MasterCard Main Stage. Near, nearly 100 great exhibitors and vendors. Delicious food and food trucks and food vendors pet adoption area opening ceremonies will with dignitaries at 11 a.m. St. Louis Balloon Brigade youth village area including video game truck fun jump obstacle courses the BJC fun at the fair experience magicians crafts uh, River City Rascals, Animal St. Louis, Scavenger Hunt, Homemade Glass, Marble Hunt, uh, Marbles by Artist Benjamin Cornwell and Ryan Nichols Shield, Live Art, Artesian Allison Smith, Artist Al Allison Smith, Type Dye Printed Shirts, Free on-site STD testing, photo booths, weddings, beer tents, wine tasting by Barefoot, and a PSC VIP access area, 21 and over. Very special thank you to all our major sponsors and sponsor you your generous contributions to help this event possible. That'll be 
June 17th from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. right there in Frontier Park. Alrighty, I guess that's enough events. Let's see what kind of time frame we're looking at here. Why, well, we're already into it for 15 minutes. Alright, I think what we're going to do is our portion of the program called Our Daily Bread. And well, prior to getting started with Our Daily Bread, we're going to give you a chance to rejuvenate your Christianhood and or become a new Christian if you would. Repeat after me. Alrighty, forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. Please cleanse my soul. Relieve me of all the guilt and the penalties. I will stop doing evil and I will start doing good. And I do believe that God has raised Jesus from the dead. And he now sits at the right hand side of God in heaven up above. And now I also accept Jesus into my heart as my Lord and Savior. And therefore I am saved in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I am also cleansed of all my sins. And if you too have followed that and read that with me, then you too can become a new Christian. And I would suggest that you get to a Bible-based church and uh, start getting yourself closer to God in the Bible. Now, if you would like to get close to God in the Bible, you should go to otb.org or pick up an Our Daily Bread at your new church and read each day's devotion. Like today being June 4th, today's devotion is called Perfect Peace. You know, you've ever had to try to find a peace within? It's kind of hard sometimes because, well, you've got so many things bouncing off the walls and going this way and yanking you that way and it's hard to find a peace perfect peace. Well, if you go into your prayer closet and you just sit and you talk to Jesus, you can find yourself a perfect peace in Him. Anyway, hey, today I'm going to be reading John 14, 25 through 31, and if you're keeping up with your Bible in a year, which I hope you are, uh, you'll be reading in the Old Testament, Second Chronicles 21 through 22, and in the New Testament, John 14. Alright, well, so you'll be reading this again later. Alrighty then. Maybe you'll understand it a little better next time. John 14, 25 through 31. These things I have spoken to you while abiding with you, but the Helper, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name. He will teach you all things and bring you and bring to you remembrances all that I said to you. Peace I leave with you and may peace I give to you not as the world gives do I give to you. Do not let your heart be troubled nor let it be fearful you you heard that I said to you I go away and I will come to you if you love me you would have rejoiced because I go to the Father and the Father is greater than I now I have told you before it happens so that when it happens you may believe I will not speak much more with you for the ruler of the world is coming, and he has nothing in me, but so that the world may know that I love the Father, I do exactly as the Father commanded me. Get up, let us go from here. And there you have it, that there is the uh, John fourteen twenty five through 31. I think I'll sing a song today, and that song is going to be well, goodbye, my friends, it's time to go. I said goodbye, my friends, it's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must go. Goodbye, my friends, goodbye. This here has been Shenandoah Bresco saying hello and how are you. You know God loves you and so do I, so 
be blessed in Jesus name and come back and see me tomorrow because well I'll be here and I hope you are too <laughs>